Hi guys! Today I want to talk about this plate carrier. It's cost-efficient plate carrier from Helicontax. I don't want to talk too much about comfort, since this mainly depends on your plates and on your whole setup. What you see here is the Guardian plate carrier in the military set. So it comes with this triple magazine front flap and also a cummerbund. You can get this for 150 euros or let's say 170 dollars in this configuration. You can also buy this plate carrier without the front flap and with no cummerbund. The first question is, is it durable and can it handle some abuse? So let's test it. So now I have built a pulley system and I can attach this to the plate carrier and I have uh, assistants with me and if they pull here they have a um, mechanical advantage and it can be pulled over the ground quite easily. So at first on the ground uh, <laughs> Yeah, super dirty. Yeah, it's uh, dirt on the ground so it's not that much of abuse. Let's wash it to check how it looks. Yeah, I think here it's just like one stitch, a little bit open because here I was hanging on a big branch or something. But all in all, it looks super nice. And yeah, Cordura is durable. Let's try the next level. Oh yeah, this looks more intense. <laughs> All right, you can see it's indeed more used, but even these seams here are still intact. The material is also still intact. Also up here, the earlier one, no problem. Everything just fine. Let's do one more strength test. Field test <laughs> improvised. Of course, this is just some basic field testing. It's not a simulation of long time use and so on, but it gives you a first impression of how well this relatively cheap plate carrier is made. So this last one was a stress test for this connection. You can see some minimal wear on the edges, but stitching everything looks still just fine. <laughs> yeah. Now let me show you the assembly because this plate carrier is shipped disassembled. All right, these are the components. It's the front, the back, the sides, the shoulder paddings and the front flap. So this is the military set. This is additional equipment. At first, you can attach the front to the back and with these shoulder pieces. Here is loop Velcro and here is hook Velcro. You have to find out what height you need and then you can do it just how you want it. Yeah, quite simple. On the back, you can open this and then inside here comes the cummerbund. So you have the right one. And left one, then this is folded down. Now on the front, just the front flap, insert the buckles up here. Now we need the plates. So I have here production group Denmark plates. that are for different plates inside. For more, check the website of the manufacturer, please. You can see it's quite tight, but this is elastic, so it fits neatly. This is folded inwards, and like that, you also close the plate compartment. So the back and the plate compartment. Now the plate for the front. Before you attach these shoulder strap covers, make sure to be uh, sure that this length is correct. And then just use this to, to cover up this Velcro, because if you don't cover this up, you could possibly get caught and open it accidentally. But here are also loops where you can additionally secure the piece underneath. You could also attach padding from other plate carriers. That's it. Ready. 
When it comes to modularity, on the back you have got a lot of molly surface. On the front you only have molly up here, and here you only have this loop surface. On the cummerbund there's also molly to attach additional pouches. You can remove the cummerbund and add almost every possible velcro in cummerbund solution. If you want to attach molly pouches to the front, you need to get the front flap with molly. When it comes to plates, they have size medium and size large, so they fit different plates inside. But the good thing is the inside of the plate carrier is elastic, so this will compensate for plus minus one centimeter approximately. For this plate carrier, there's a lot of accessories, so let me show you some of them here on the ground. So these are some accessories. For example, what I really like is the quick release cummerbund. It comes with one piece for the shoulder straps and with two cummerbunds. I already attached some additional pouches from Helicontex. So now let's add this quick release thing. At first you have to, have to decide which side you want to be opened. You can use either one, the right or the left one. I want to attach it to the left side, since on the right side there's the rifle stock. You just open this velcro closure, then you thread it through this buckle. Now on the inside you have a loop here, stick this through. And then you have loop surface where you can just secure this. So this is a safe connection. And this piece now can be attached to the shoulder piece. Just like that to make it fit the other side. And then again I add this cover. Okay, for the cummerbund. So on the front you have these parts. So this is the left one and this is the right one. So now you don't need to use this velcro closure anymore to open the plate carrier. Now on the back, open the blade compartment and the back. Remove the standard cummerbund and now attach the new one. Maybe like that and this one. And now again close the plate compartment. Now time for the other additional equipment. For example, they have this small backpack. For a hydration bladder, for example, it also comes with some straps to wear it on the shoulder, but you can also attach this on the back of the plate carrier. Then they have an admin pouch, and this can be mounted to the chest, for example. Of course, all Velcro accessories, just like this dangler, can also be attached quite easily. You can attach it to this front closure, or you attach it to the plate compartment. They also have this universal thing which you can use for a radio for example and you can velcro this just to the sides underneath the buckle for example. Now we have the fully equipped plate carrier with everything we could need and of course you can attach all other molly pouches to this carrier or even other front flaps if you want to. Of course this is not a full kit but if you are interested in tactical gear or also in outdoor products, things for bushcraft or for the range, make sure to check out Helicontext's website. I will link them down in the description. Of course, there is no universal plate carrier which is suitable for everyone and every mission. It's a really individual topic. Let's get to the conclusion. What I like about this plate carrier is the minimalistic and low profile design. It's lightweight and made from Cordura, so it should be durable. Yeah, that's it. Tell me in the comments have you heard about Helicontext before and do you like the quality? Thanks, bye!